230 families affected by the Enhanced Movement Control Order, or MCO, in Section 2 Bukit Gasing Pataling Jaya receive fresh produce from the Bukit Gasing Assembly men on Thursday. So what we are doing from the Pejabat Adun Bukit Gasing is to try to ease the, the situation for the residents. Most of them have run out of fresh produce by now. It's the fifth day of the lockdown. We have many types of vegetables that we are giving in the pack as well as fish. We have uh, six types of fish, a little bit of each, each variety. He said the welfare department would deliver the second round of dry goods to the residents on Friday. My second round of fresh produce will be vegetable and chicken. It will be next Tuesday. We are not allowed to go inside. You mean inside the barbed wire. Okay, how is so, the food delivered to them? JKM. Yesterday evening, the vegetables arrived in the crates and my volunteers, which are mostly residents in Old Town who are outside the barbed wire. So we, were, we packed all the vegetables into the, the, the plastic, big plastic bags. This morning, early morning, the fish came. So 7.30, we started packing the fish into the, the frozen fish into the bags. As and when JKM, the pickup truck will come, take 30 packs, go give, come back, pack 30 packs, go and give. The PJ Old Town area has been placed under the enhanced MCO since last Sunday after 26 positive COVID-19 cases were detected there. The order will last until May 23rd.